What's going on, guys? Stefan here from App Stuff, and I am so excited that you decided to join me on this amazing journey of how to build apps with Swift UI. So we're gonna have a ton of fun, but first we need to go over what you need to get started. So there's gonna be one thing that is required and one thing that is optional. So make sure you stick with me to the end of this video to make sure that you have everything you need to get started on our journey here. So the first thing, and this is required guys, is that you have Xcode downloaded. Now at the time of this video, um, Xcode recently released an update. So the, most, the newest version is Xcode 15. So go ahead and get that downloaded. And this is what we're gonna be using to build our applications. We're gonna write all of our code here to ultimately build out these awesome applications that we uh, are gonna see in the bootcamp. So that's thing number one, and that is required. So how do we get that if you don't already have it? So you're gonna open up the App Store, guys, and you're gonna search for Xcode. That's just X-C-O-D-E up in the search bar up here. And then you're just gonna select this option and you are gonna hit download. So that might take a bit of time to download, but once you get that downloaded, just go ahead and come back to this video. So thing number two, this is optional, not required, is going to be the Programming Fundamentals Bootcamp, guys. So this is an optional prerequisite and it's available to you 100% free on the YouTube channel as well. Just head over to the channel, guys, go to the playlist section and you should see it right there next to the Swift UI Development Bootcamp. So just recommended that you take that to get a strong foundation in the programming fundamentals before you start trying to apply those concepts when it comes to building mobile apps. Like I said, it's not required to take this to start this bootcamp, but at some point you guys are definitely gonna wanna go through this bootcamp to really have a firm understanding of the fundamentals as the app development stuff starts to get a little more complex. So without further ado, guys, let's go ahead and get started with setting up our Xcode project so that we can start learning how to build iPhone apps with Swift UI. This is gonna be so exciting, and I'm so excited to have you guys on board with me. Let's go ahead and jump into the next video to get started.